Welcome to the Lawrence Tech Sports Network. We're here with uh, head coach Will Dyer after a 4 nothing win over Siena Heights on homecoming. Uh, Will, what a game. Uh, things were going our way. Well, it was a great game. Uh, guys have been working hard, especially after that double overtime win of Mary Grove. Um, wanted to rejuvenate the guys, get them eased back in. We uh, changed some things with our starting lineup because we saw some things based on that Mary Grove game and during the week of training. It paid off. We scored on three corners. We've been working hard on our set pieces, and we got to keep working hard. Combination play up top between center mids, mids, and defenders has improved, but we know we can't take a day off. Indiana Tech is waiting, ready for us on Wednesday, and then we travel to Lourdes, so it's, every day is a battle. Talk about the uh, corner kicks today. They were, uh, you guys were quality on the kicks, and uh, you scored off two of them, so. Well, today it was quality. Today it was. <laughs> Impressive. We were able to score on three of them. Um, it's just our boys, their, their character just speaks volumes of their character and their hard work and our assistant coaches putting in their work and all of it just coming together. And it was a great day for it, a great crowd. And it's always great to win the homecoming game. Talk about the defense, your defensive line, and then Max and Goal. I mean, they didn't have that many shots today, but they were able to uh, keep the ball pretty much in yeah, I mean, uh, our offensive zone. <laughs> The big thing with the back line is just communicate. Two center backs know they have to be the loudest communicators and set everything up. They're actually the first offense for us. Once they get the ball, they need to look forward, get it forward. But they all did a great job, I thought. Uh, Jose stayed on his feet. Uh, we had Michael moved over right back. We had North, we had Santi. We were able to get Bryce in. In the second half of center back, we were able to play Alaman and Hawaii did a great job. It's just all of them feeding off of each other and growing together as a unit. It's going to make us much better. What do you think a game like this and the game against Mary Grove will do for the guys going forward now in the wax season where two wins, one tie? Um, I mean, it definitely gives us confidence, but we can't get overconfident. Every game is a battle. We know Indiana Tech is a great coach, great players. We know Lords is athletic, another great program with a well, very well coach. Every game's a battle. This is just going to help us prepare. We have to learn from our mistakes, break down the film, and get ready for Indiana Tech on Wednesday. All right, coach. Thanks a lot. Congratulations. Hey, That's a good win.